Trad TV live in effect, raw and uncut, bringing it to you live, man. I want to start by saying I apologize about the last week and a half. Um, I had a little mishap. Um, I think somebody had broken my car and uh, took my ca my camera. I'm being dead serious right now. Um, my door handle uh, was jigged with a little bit or whatnot. Um, I had a little scratch on it, so like somebody took a screwdriver or whatnot and like you know try to jigsaw whatever you want to call it, the knob. So came back and the camera was missing and I know they had to take my camera because I just put it in there like the night that it went missing so um I was like you know maybe I misplaced it you know what I'm talking about so I was like me look for it so try looking for it for like you know a little while it ain't show up so I was like damn I was like man god damn lady so I was like, God, you know, I was like, man, like, I gotta get another camera. So that's what we at, man. We back in effect right now, man. Trap TV, I ain't gonna leave y'all hanging like that, man. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, I apologize. You know, we got some thieves out here in the world. Um, I was very, very pissed about it because I felt violated. I don't know if y'all ever had y'all shit broken into, but if you haven't, um, it's a very ill feeling. Like, I, I, I really felt violated. Like, like I felt disrespected, um, like, you know, I feel like that's my privacy, that's my car. Obviously, people do not care or whatnot, but, you know, so, you know, I felt violated, felt disrespected, but, you know, what can you do? So, um, yeah, so that's what it been, man. That's what I've been dealing with, man. So, you know, but like I said, man, we're back in effect right now. So, just got done working out. I'm about to hit this uh, Starbucks up. I ain't a big Starbucks fan until recently because I guess every Starbucks got um, their own menu. I don't know if it depends on the location or what, but... A couple of Starbucks I went to, unless I'm tripping, y'all let me know if I'm tripping because I could be tripping. Um, I went to a couple of Starbucks and I ain't ever seen certain things on the menu that others had. And like I said, unless I'm tripping, but the Starbucks I've been to lately, you know, got these uh, these breakfast sandwiches. On it's two of them. I think one's like a like a I think it's like a Monterey Jack and cheese sausage sandwich or something. The other one's like a you know kind of like a regular sausage egg and cheese biscuit sandwich but the moderate jack what well, you both of them going ham man like the other day they was out of the moderate jack and cheese one so i got the other one the other one was just good so lately i've been knocking things back you know so but yeah that's why I'm, that's why i'm headed to now and then they got some other stuff coffee you know y'all some you know coffee connoisseurs or whatever i ain't a big coffee connoisseur you know like you know i don't really drink coffee i prefer red bull if i need to wake up or something but yeah so that's what it is right now man so i'm gonna wait to starbucks man or whatnot. Got some errands running late on the day. You know, it's about seven in the morning right now. I had to get this workout in. About to go to Starbucks, get something to eat, and go back to the crib, lay it down. I got some errands running late on. So, you know, that's what it is, though. But, so, get back at y'all, man. So, we at Starbucks right now. And if you are a Starbucks connoisseur, like I said, as you can imagine, the line is right around the freaking building. And I don't feel like waiting that long. But I want the sandwich. That's bruh man from the fifth floor say. Damn dude, this is crazy. Oh shit, and this cop behind me trying to squeeze in here. Cause another cop behind me trying to squeeze in. So we got two cars trying to squeeze in. So it might be some horn beeping and some cussing out. You know, if I can get that, you know, I'm gonna get it raw and uncut. I'm getting out the car and recording all that. And they try to cuss me out, it's gonna be consequences and repercussions. Yeah, she about to try to swerve in here. Okay, my Starbucks day, what can we do for you? Yes, may I have the uh, spicy chorizo moderate jack and egg, please? Unfortunately, we are out of that sandwich this morning. Can we interest you in something else? Oh, man, y'all was out yesterday, too. Oh, no. <laughs> we got an order today, though, so tomorrow we should have it. <laughs> All right, then. Can I just have the uh, sausage and cheddar breakfast sandwich, then? Absolutely. Any drinks with that? Nah, I'm cool. Okay, oh, this is just going to be 381, and I'll see you up here. Thank you. All right, thank you. Man, shoot. They was out the other day, too. See, let me tell y'all something. That ain't right. I want my moderate Jack and Chorizo on sandwich, man. Messing my morning up right now, man. But like I told you, the sausage breakfast, whatever I just ordered was good, too. So, uh, you know, I ain't too disappointed. But I ooh, the cops. Oh, time to go. At the outlet in Charleston. This nigga wants to cook Yeah, 
fall out. <laughs> I ain't lie, these cookies do look kind of good though. How much three of them cost? Give me a cookie now. Well, in the express store right now, Ollie gotta find a shirt for a banquet. So, I gotta return some stuff I got. So, you know, uh, got some skinnies, dope skinnies. But I just don't know if, how they fit, cause my thighs, I got like big thighs, so I don't know if the skinnies will work like that. So, I'm trying to figure out if I wanna get the skinnies or not, but I'm gonna return them and wait for another time. But, We'll see though. But for now, I'm gonna take them back. But the skinny's dope, man. I ain't never wore skinnies. I don't know how they gonna look on me. Cause like I say, I got big thighs. So, might not look right. But, that's all we got going right now. Probably gonna do too much tonight. Probably like sitting back, you know, drinking a couple Coronas, pass out on the couch. And uh, send some drunk tests out of the missing. You ain't like that one. It fit? Somebody, you can get you another. How about a whip on the baby? I blow a bag today. How about a whip on the baby? I blow a bag today. I blow a bag today. I blow a bag today. Try to rock out with the blue. Rock out with the sock out. And the jacket kind of dope, though. Y'all feeling that jacket right there? This part, not this part. It's all right now, look at it, it's all right. So I'm trying to come to Patton Express and get something to eat, right? And why they got a shopping cart in the middle of the damn drive through I mean, do that mean they ain't open or something? But we about to find out, cause I'm hungry. Somebody about to serve me some of this bootleg Chinese food. That's bullshit. Y'all yeah, ain't not serving nobody no food or something? Thank you for choosing Pan Express, who you speaking? Would you like to charge you no know, such chicken? Uh, no thank you. Okay, what can I get for you? Can I get a two entree? What's your side order? Uh, can I, may I have orange chicken? Okay, our size is the fried rice, I mean. Uh, fried rice. Like Chinese food? Okay, Something and then like orange that. chicken, what's gonna be your other entree? And black pepper chicken. Okay, I got a plate with so fried rice, black pepper, so orange, any egg rolls, spring rolls, or drink? Mm, no, um, no, neither. Uh, one second. Okay, take okay. your time. What kind of rice they got? You get fried rice, regular rice, noodles. I want some orange chicken with some fried rice. Like an entree or a bowl? If you just want orange chicken and fried rice, you can get a, you can get orange chicken and fried rice in a bowl. Yeah, that's fine. See? All right, may I add another bowl to that? Okay, what's the side order for the bowl? Uh, orange chicken with regular white rice. No, sure. Okay, I got a pan I mean, of I mean, white I'll, rice and orange. Any egg rolls, spring rolls, or drinks for this uh -huh. one? Uh-huh, fried rice. I, I'm, you know, shrimp fried rice. You can get fried rice. Or you, can get, you can get fried rice. All right, can I change the white rice to fried rice on the bowl? I'm sorry about that. That's fine. Okay, yeah. You know, okay, let's complete though. your order. You heard me? Yeah, that's it. Yeah, that, that's it. Okay, one second for your total. Alright. I'm talking about shrimp fried rice. And I just told the nigga this shit was bootleg Chinese food. You don't get no shrimp fried rice, you get fried rice. Am I tripping or didn't she say wait for the total? So I don't know whether to drive or to wait. I don't know. What y'all think? You said drive forward or wait for the total? Oh, 1414 14 at the window. Okay. Alright. Man, what be wrong with people, man? I, I don't get people. People be driving here tripping, man. They better stop that, man. That ain't cool. Put her ass on Trav TV with that BS she got going on up there. So we don't tolerate that. Moving
What up, what up? What's happening? Back at it right now. About to get this work in. Um, about to get some hitting done. Down here in Chuck Town. Bye. Where them boys get you at? Down here. That bye. That's how they talk. I thought I talked messed up. Y'all down here in Charleston, boy. Y'all get you. It's hell. But that's cool, though. I ain't got nothing, ain't got nothing, wrong, ain't nothing wrong with that. That's what's up. But nah, about to get this work in right now. What not? About 30, 40 minutes. And then, uh, about to go to beat us and watch some football. Because I got fantasy football and I got to keep up with my teams. So, that's what we got going today, man. What up? Let me holler at y'all for a second. Got to tell y'all about us. So, so, I tell y'all, I was coming to Buffalo Wild Wing, right? So, I get in the uh, I get in the Buffalo Wild Wings and the lady or this, the the chick that always be like one of the chicks that work at the bar. She was like, as soon as I get in, she was like, uh, she's like, hey, she's like, last time you came in, um, you walked out and didn't pay your tab. I said, what? She said, yeah, you walked and didn't pay your tab. I said, you got me mixed up with somebody else. I said, that wasn't me. And she was like, you didn't have the food to go last time. I said, uh, no, that wasn't me. She was like, oh, oh, she's like, yeah, I was, I was telling, um, the, uh, Steve, the guy that, nah, that didn't him. He comes in all the time. He, he, he wouldn't do that like that. I said, yeah, y'all gonna mix up with somebody. Uh, I said, uh, I said, trust me. I said, that wasn't me or whatever. I said, I didn't pay my tab. I ain't coming back there and dike myself. But I was like, man, y'all tripping. This gonna accuse me of not paying my tab. Damn, beat up. That how really how y'all gonna do? And then I got another question. Why is it that if like you from like me, I'm from South Carolina, and I tell I tell somebody that I'm like one of the dudes at the bar we was talking, he was like, Yeah, he's like, Who's your football team? So I was like, Man, I'm a Vikings fan. He was like, Man, he's like, How you a Vikings fan from South Carolina? Why I gotta be a Carolina Panthers fan? Because I'm in Carolina. If you from freaking California, you wanna be a Pittsburgh Steelers fan? That's who you root for. How you get the root for that team? I don't know. My reason is I was young and Randy Moss and long story, but no, I like I can't root for the Vikings because I, I ain't from Minnesota. That's my team. No hate. I don't know how people all do that. How you gonna root for such and such when you from such and such? The same reason why the sky blue. Just because it is and because I want to. Now.